in March 2021, we presented a plaque to Jim Teffer, father of Highlands Ranch. Today, April of 2021, we are presenting a marker on the home, the first home closed in Highlands Ranch. We are celebrating, continuing our celebration of the 40th anniversary of Highlands Ranch. And so we're going to introduce the uh, first homeowners here, Philip and Kay Scott on the end. They were the very first people to close on a home in Highlands Ranch. And then the current homeowners of this home, uh, Judith and Paul Steiner. Philip and Kay, would you mind just saying a few words about the home and, and your purchase of it? Yes, we were a young couple. We bought it, lived in it 11 years. We had a daughter that was not quite a year old. We were really pleased to move into it. We were lucky and in the drawing got 12% interest rate, which at the time was phenomenal. And we moved out of the country into here and we're really glad we did. My wife Kay will tell you more. Uh, our daughter, was Sarah, was nine months old the day we moved in and she took her first steps because she wasn't afraid to fall on the carpet. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, we've been uh, we've uh, we bought the house from the Scots, and we are we've been here 28 years, and we originally lived in a condo. This is our first actual home, and uh, we uh, bought the house because uh, we love the view in the back, and of course, uh, at that point, uh, housing was hard to find, so so we so we uh, took it as soon as we as soon as we saw it. So uh, anyway, uh, it's it, we love we love Highlands Ranch, and we you know we hopefully continue to live here for several more years. And so I'd like to read what the plaque says. It says the Highlands Ranch Historical Society recognizes the first Highlands Ranch home. The date sold was September 28, 1981, and the builder was Mission Viejo. Thank you for letting us put the plaque on your home, and thank you for coming. Thank you. Thank you, thank you for having us.